Hi, I'm Eric with Bay East Association of Realtors. I wanted to talk to you about a serious issue growing locally and it's concerning our Bay East members and it has to do with squatters. So what is a squatter and how are they affecting you? It's a person who does not own, rent or otherwise have permission to use an abandoned or unoccupied residential building. How big of a problem has this become locally? Well, it has stemmed enough interest that Bay East hosted a round table to address the growing issue. In attendance was Alameda County Sheriff Sergeant Lawrence Simeon. As Simeon's discussed tactics used by the squatters and how realtors and property owners can respond. Check your property. Do not let their property just sit there and you do not know what's going on with your property. You are asking for trouble. You will go there five, six months later and find out that somebody's sitting in your property. You can't do that. I know there's a lot of property now and I know it's a problem, but you have to police your property. So, what can you do to protect your listings from squatters? Here's a list of the top 10 ways to protect yourself and your clients. Number one, only take listings you can get to easily. Visit your listing at least once a week. Realtors are in and out quite a bit. So remember, did you turn the lights off, the air off, the heat off? Did you lock the doors? Number two, keep the grass cut. Keep newspapers and mail from piling up. Now, if it looks like no one lives there, more than likely a squatter will be more attracted to the property. Number three, if you can easily see into the vacant property, think about staging it. This may cost some money initially, but may save you money in the long run. And number four, if this is a conventional sale and your clients are able, make sure that their taxes are paid and current. Remember, squatters are even paying taxes to adversely occupy and take ownership of properties. Number five, if the squatters are armed with documentation, law enforcement has no way of discerning whether this is a criminal or civil matter. Have your client file an unlawful detainer immediately. Number six, uh, for your safety, never ever get into an altercation with squatters. Uh, call law enforcement if an engagement is necessary. Number seven, if a squatter occupies your listing or client's property, be sure to notify your local DA's office immediately to notify them of the situation. And number eight, as simple as it sounds, keep a light on inside the property. It'll help keep the bad guys away. And number nine, make sure the property is secure at all times. And finally, stay alert and informed. If your property is occupied, document as much as possible, and this will help the DA's office if it becomes a criminal matter. Well, I hope these 10 tips helped you become more aware of squatters and what to do if you ever encounter one in your business. Now, if you'd like more information about squatters, Please feel free to contact the Bay East Public Affairs Director, uh, David Stark, at 925-730-4068 or davidus at bayeast.org. Thanks for watching.